the next game, well, Metal Slug 3. It's going to be terrible. Let's not play it. Oh, Metal Slug again. Yeah. So far. Jeez Louise, am I right? With two O's. Since we're playing the Thunder version, we can actually get access to various controls and stuff, but uh, we're just going to leave everything at standard. You're not going to turn it up to Hero 5. No. Uh, let's play as Tama this time. Mission one, start. First up, giant enemy crabs. <laughs> I think you know what to do. Throw grenades at them? That too. Make crab cakes. Why are there just missiles in the ground everywhere? Remains from the, uh... I don't know. Super grenade! Not your mother's grenade! These are super grenades, buddy. And I am actually just completely ignoring that thing because... I want to take this path instead. Oh, and run straight into a claw. Help. And now it's giant crickets instead. Oh, is that a... no, that's a locust, isn't it? Yeah, that's a locust. Yeah, I was gonna say, I think it's a locust. Get out of here, locusts. No one likes you. You are horribly disgusting. And you eat I things. wonder why all these prisoners of war have power-ups in their pants. Well, where would they keep them? They don't have anything else. Uh, that's an interesting point. I guess in their shoes? Uh, well, I'll just leave you to it, buddy. Nope. What's he doing? He's trying to bilge the water out. Hilarious amounts of missiles. Or actually, those are unguided, so I suppose they're rockets. I think they're bombs. I'm sure they're just bombs. Oh, oh but I agree with you not being hilarious. Oh god, you're fat. Not fat. <laughs> big. They actually changed that. Oh shit. <laughs> Murder oh, fish. I love the heavy machine gun bullets though. For There's something wonderful about the art style of this too. You're just sitting on the boat, shooting fish. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, right, you can actually... Oh god, giant enemy crab! Get away from me! I'm amazed they don't make the metal slug fat. And then there's this POW, and he's like, yeah, you know. Oh, I'm just walking around. Oh, here. Got my undies. A giant enemy crab, you say? Interesting. Yeah, I've seen the, I've seen more interesting things. Explain to uh, Lurk Copter how, what the point of a big pickup is. Well, basically, you get fat. There is no point. You're just fat. It's hilarious. <laughs> You actually walk slightly slower and you can't jump as high, but you get special animations as you see there. For example, Tommy just had himself a donut and basically <laughs> ate his own hand in the process. <laughs> right, so after giant enemy crabs, zombies. Our scientists! Do you get zombies? Do you get the zombie disease in this? Yes, this is the game where you can get the zombie disease. You must become zombie Tarma.
Oh no! You got Who zombied. was zombied? I can't save anyone! No, you uh, can't. You are terrible! That's <laughs> not my job anyway. Oh, a letter. Wait, your job is to kill zombies. It doesn't matter if they didn't used to be zombies a few minutes ago because of you. Let's see if I your can actually walk down here. There we go. Don't worry, Mr. President. I'm here to save you. Thundercloud. He just summons them out of nowhere. Uh, he has his men summon them for him. No, he summoned the men out of nowhere. Yes. Well, they're, they're the men in black. You know. And yes. Ape. Hey, you saved one person. Two persons. Also, monkey power. I am a zombie now. All we want to do is eat your breakfast. Zombies puke blood. Pretty awesome, too. Yeah, I don't know why you can't be a fat zombie. <laughs> Boomer! No. I'm oh, not answering that quiet. phone call. Seriously, people. God damn it, you know I'm streaming. <laughs> Probably relatives want to wish you happy birthday. Screw relatives. <laughs> I'm no relation of yours. Oh, wait, actually, I am. Wait, if the zombie bomb is uncensored, why isn't the zombie puking uncensored? Wouldn't that be blood, too, or is it just puke? Nice, no, it's, re it's a regular puke. Coming out from their stomachs? I think it's it's special acid, you know, steaming puke, but it's still puke. Puke generally comes from somewhere around the stomach area, so... Well, their stomach rips open and sprays out that stuff. I don't think it's yeah. puke. They don't look much Whee. like puke, it looks like they're exploding their chest. Like some kind of chest burster. Aliens! Secret area! Ooh. With frozen people. And Yeti! Yep. <laughs> the angry snowman. <laughs> Ooh, not doing too good, are there? Hey. If you shake the joystick quickly enough, you can actually escape, but... It's sort of hard, honestly. It should also be noted that... Uh... <laughs> oh no, not the bouncy stay. Oh, so terrible. Uh, it should also be noted that each snowman sprite actually has an individual look depending on which character you're playing. <laughs> it's those cute little touches that make a game. Also, the snowmen are angry. angry God damn it, stop chasing me! Heavy, heavy machine gun, gun. Screw you, Yetis. Well, you are kind of inv invading their home. Alright, so we're gonna be playing this later, I guess, then with co-op. Bunny doll! 
Yay, bunny! With panty shots, apparently. Ow. Elephant! <laughs> Why is that <laughs> elephant still alive? Magic. Because it's awesome, that's why. Okay. Your question help. is, who managed to get a gun on an elephant? Some elephant! I think I was going to die here because I actually want to ride the elephant. And he immediately falls on me to kill me instead, the son of a bitch. <laughs> now it's his job and everything. You know. Oh well. Guess I'm leaving you behind, Mr. Elephant. Right. Yes, oh. get in the elephant. Yeah. Oh, there's several. Similar in? What do you mean in? In the That's camel. The... Yeah, in the camel. In the elephant. <laughs> this game is very, very disturbing. Sort of difficult to escape once you're zombified with the situation being what it is. Yeah. She literally just explodes. Everyone else's head falls off. She explodes. Also note that that ice there actually cracks if you walk over it with the elephant and the elephant falls down. Aww. How many times do I have to shoot you? God damn it. Zombie soldiers! Nazi zombies! See, she explodes! Everyone else in the head pops. She explodes! Turtle. It'd be better if it weren't purple. <laughs> I think the purpleness uh, takes away from the, the true zombie gore, which is really what you're there for, you know? Mm hmm. Yeah, Mysterious right. Meteor. Now this boss is hilarious as well because this one has... Well... Basically if you get the timing just right, you can... Those are freaking awesome looking aliens. Yeah, you can basically defeat the boss without it having time to go into its uh, proper pattern, but I can't reliably do that at all. Okay. Basically, you can beat it before it starts doing this bullshit. When it's just they're all grouped together? Yeah. And then comes the actual boss. Now, there's a really funny thing about this boss, because there is a particular frame on the screen you can't stand without these things actually hitting you. <laughs> are they... are they... shooting giant monoliths? Yes, they are. There is like a two-frame width somewhere on the screen that I <laughs> sadly have not memorized. That if you stand there, it will continuously drop them on you, but they won't actually hurt you. Sadly, I'm not entirely sure where that position is. <laughs> Yay, Metal Solid 3! I think all games like this, if they have four continues, they have four different characters. It's just so much. And he's just walking back and forth between the monoliths <laughs> forever. <laughs> Same game over screen, screen as all the games. And I'm in first place. If it well works, done. don't change it. 
Metal Slug 3. This is actually a favorite among speedrunners for various reasons, mainly because there are a lot of little tricks like that and the boss patterns are pretty much preset. So once you've mastered a boss fight, you can do it without getting killed, basically. Alright, Metal Slug 3. Good times.